Well, parking in New York City may soon be as easy as a few taps on your cell phone. CBS 2's Janelle Burrell explains how a new app could revolutionize parking in the five boroughs. Ask any driver in New York City and most will tell you that they've been a victim of a muni meter meltdown. Sometimes it doesn't work, sometimes you don't have a quarter and you, you go to park the meter and, and uh, you're going to go move, park your car and you come back and the meter man is already on top of you giving you a ticket. But now there's an app for that, pay by phone. Here on Arthur Avenue in the Bronx, Renato Cuadrado's parking woes of dealing with receipts and coins and sometimes broken meters are now made simpler using his cell phone to pay for a spot. I think it's pretty good. I like the way it works. Since the spring, the city has been trying out the pay by phone app here on Arthur Avenue. Once you sign up for an account, you provide your license plate number and your credit card information. Then when you use the service, you enter the location number of the meter closest to you. Your parking fees will then be billed directly to your credit card. Now there are plans to expand the program to all 14,000 meters across the five boroughs. It's more convenient. Sometimes you don't have change in your pocket. Sometimes you may not have a credit card or a debit card. You can just use your phone. So what it means is no more need for these little receipts inside your windshield. Traffic enforcement agents will be able to tell whether you've paid by your license plate and the location number of the meter. This technology is going to really help a lot of people and I think it's great. I really do. If you don't have access to a cell phone, you can use any other online device or phone it in by calling a toll free number. In the Belmont section of the Bronx, Janelle Burrell, CBS 2 News. One extra feature of the app, it will send you a text alert to warn you that your time is about to expire. The program is set to roll out citywide in 2015.